I want to put you guys down as some hopefully documenting that nothing happens. <laughs> it's like one of those Halloween things where I got stuck at the I know. <laughs> <laughs> Which one's he gonna go for? Just stuck in that house. That's a blue balloon, Remy. Remy, say balloon. Yeah, you were saying it earlier. She's like, how do I, how do I get there? there. I think I got it. <laughs> She's like, I gotta line them up. Line them up. There we go. Okay, line them up. Get ready for the attack. Uh-oh, alarm. That means you gotta go. Did you say something about my mama? You tell him. I think it was the poop. Yeah, did you pick it up? Watch this, Remy. Now hold it. Hold it right there. You got it? Look at, get your own balloons. Get your own balloons. Whoa. Whoa, angry. See, I guess she points to the other one like, oh. you're next. So we couldn't get the RV to start. After some uh, exploring, my dad, I know it looks like he's about to get the guillotine right now, we finally found out those are the coach batteries right there. And there's a uh, ignition battery that I found when going underneath this thing. It's right there. And he brought this <laughs> so we can charge it up. And it just looks hilarious because right now it looks like he's about to chop himself. So I'm gonna put you guys down as some hopefully documenting that nothing happens. <laughs> Looks like one of those Halloween things where I got stuck at the I know. that was born like a week and a half ago. My cousin, my other cousin, her brother, ended up having a baby girl and now my cousin's having a baby. Lots of little babies are being brought into this world. So we decided it would be Caitlin, myself, and my grandma. We're just gonna go over, we're gonna hang out with her. Uh, we have a couple things to bring to her. Yeah, we have some great food. We brought the girls. We're just gonna hang out because they've been quarantining nonstop. It's gonna be nice and relaxing. We had a little issue, a little hiccup with the RV. I'm sure Char's gonna kind of fill you in on all of that. That's speak of the devil. But thankfully we were able, Remy's awake, darn it. Hopefully we can get this RV done in the, within the next two weeks. I don't know. Our time frame is very exaggerated right now. We don't really know when things are gonna actually get done. Things keep popping up. Like Caitlin here. Caitlin flips houses with her husband. It doesn't happen where you have like a plan, you, you want to get everything done by a certain time and then it ends up having like a hiccup. Something happens like this. All the time. See? My dad and I are on another mission because we have no idea what's going on with the battery, so we're gonna have to wait for Chewy. In the meantime, we're gonna try to figure out some lighting situations, like, yeah, hopefully the fluorescent, oh, that's a curb. Oh, Chewy's that. There it is. Nothing's ever in easy. Nothing's, I mean, if everyone remembers when you and I tried to do the golf cart batteries, and yeah. it almost blew up, that was fun. Yes, it was. There's nothing on there now. Back up, because if I touch this. Yeah. What the f 
Very interesting. Yeah, but it's probably good entertainment for everybody so they can tell it's us Like the Blues Brothers, we're on a mission from God. Yeah. Here's the predicament we're running into. So we have the fluorescent light bulbs that are currently on there, but they're kind of like a cool white, so it's kind of got that hint of yellow. So we're going to try to find daylight bulbs, or we're going to completely revamp and do the uh, LED. But if we do the LED, the problem that actually happens is that there's going to be extra space that we're going to have to create that covers the holes. And what sucks is right now, I have to, it doesn't even look different. This is kind of the color we're looking at right now that's in the RV. And this is kind of like what we need. That's kind of the RV right now. All that is kind of like the, the cool light or whatever it is. And then we have to try to get more of that. But the problem is that does not exist. So I'm not sure if you guys can see the difference, but now that they're next to each other, you 100% can. Ugh. Getting rid of this thing finally, because I've hit my head a million times. I think my dad's done the same thing. And we got this nice little pancake lens. So that way it lends. I'm so used to that with a camera. <laughs> Thanks, Savannah. And uh, that way it's nice and flush and we're not going to bump each other's heads. Oh, this is the goal. And you saw the lighting, so now we don't have to redo this entire situation here because then it would create, we would have to design something to offset this whole creasing molding thing. Let's see if it works. Okay. Oh, cool. Got a blue light there and turn it right on. Is it on? It was. <laughs> All right, well, that's nice. I mean, it's a little yellow, but... It's not yellow. It's bright. It's right in my ass. <laughs> Between oh, the two. Yeah, it is a little yellowish. But that's but it's okay. Still, it's a lot brighter in which hat, and it's not going to hit your head. Yeah, that's, I mean, the point, we're probably never going to use that anyway, so. Getting there. Can't start the stupid thing, but we're at least getting the lighting and stuff taken care of. Like the yeah. <laughs> just get it downhill, we'll be fine. Just to show you what we just did that was different. So this was the original right here, and this is the new one, where you can barely even see it. Now you won't hit your head. Look at that. I got some clearance. Pop. The pop tea. Pop tea. Are you eating a french fry? Beep. That'll be easy once she gets going though. That's got to be one of the easiest oh, it's, things. Oh, that's going to be yeah. so easy. Lights. Lights. You like the new lights there, Rem? Instead of these ugly ones? Well, we weren't able to unfortunately get the thing started, but Chewie's going to come over and help us. I mean, if anything, we got this taken care of. We got some molding for this. We're gonna put it around there to cover up all the parts that we had to saw off, as you saw. We got the new lighting. We installed some new lighting. We did some stuff back there. You saw the difference between the lights. It's insane. I don't know what we're gonna do with this. I kind of want to burn it. <laughs> I want to burn this thing when we burn the mask for my face. We don't need to replace all those things because then we would have to do molding and it's extra work. So thank God that's the case. And now. I just gotta get these little guys and then decide if we're going to switch out this right here over there. I don't know if the plastic's gonna be good. I guess it would be because that's plastic too. Now we just gotta get the stupid thing to chewy. <laughs> so I still haven't quite decided what I wanted to do with my hair or like if I wanted to cut it or like shave it or something like that. So I'm still kind of little by little, I think I showed you guys yesterday, it's still coming out. I legit didn't even see it there. Get off of there. You know you're not supposed to get off. You know you're not supposed to be right there. I literally thought it was the pillow. The one thing that we were really trying to get was the, uh, the chassis to turn on so we can turn the ignition on so we could actually take the RV to where we need to get it. But we were able to get a bunch of cool lighting in there. I'm impressed with the, the progress we actually did. We found, okay, so I learned something. The ignition, the chassis battery, is not where all the other batteries are. It was hidden underneath, <laughs> like it looked like it was in the front of the, the, the hood, which is kind of funny how class A hoods are. It looked like it was trying to eat my dad. <laughs> it looked like a horror film. Like, a, like a, what is it, Carmageddon or something like that? Or, is this a horror film where a car eats people? Is that, isn't there? Could have sworn. Or is that a Simpsons episode? All blends together. Chewie is going to come over here and help us figure out what the heck's going on. We thought it was something silly, but it actually might be something that's even sillier that we aren't even thinking about. Cause they're always something, you know what I mean? It's always one little step. It's like, oh, I should have done that. Like we've been doing the RV stuff for like four or five years now and we're still learning. I was able to just kind of relax and chill with my dad. We were able to 
you know, get some things done. I was able to keep my mind off of things. It's been really nice knowing, like this morning, I woke up later and I knew I didn't have to go to the bathroom too. Thank God for the viewfinder. It was nice to not have to wake up super early and rush, like the whole family rush. When I woke up, I was like, oh, we gotta rush. You know, I'm so used to it for the past six weeks. Didn't have to do that. So it was really nice. I wanted to document what we were doing with the RV because of the fact that this is a huge process and it's been like kind of a, a fun thing to do. And I found out a lot of you guys, not a lot of you guys, some of you guys, <laughs> every one of you guys are renovating RVs right now. We're all playing off each other, which is kind of, that's actually kind of cool. I gotta be a little quieter because I know little Sprout is sleeping right now. So, or trying to go to sleep, Allie's putting her to bed. I'll see you guys tomorrow. If you don't watch yesterday's video, when I rang the bell, because radiation was done, go watch yesterday's video. Bye guys.